What is up guys this is Tito back with another video on the Redmi K20 Pro and today in this video I'm gonna be showing you how can you fix the Google app data backup well I have been thinking about doing a video on this from a long time and I did couple of them like how do I backup everything or every stuff over here while I flash ROM or before I flash ROM so yeah but right now I'm gonna show you how to actually fix the problem to backup your things on the Google Drive or your Google App Data Backup section. First of all, let me show you. I am on the 27th August 2020 build of this Evolution X ROM. And as you can see, the security patch and stuff is latest of August 5th, 2020 here. And in the system panel, if I go into the backup section here, as you can see, it shows this waiting to backup. Well, this waiting to backup problem is a really like weird problem. Sometimes you cannot simply backup even when you are connected to a proper Wi-Fi over here. And this Wi-Fi network over here, which I'm connected to right now is in this particular room. So even when I am connected to a Wi-Fi network like this, it still shows me waiting to backup. So all you can do to fix this problem is remove any kind of security from your device. That will include your pattern, your pin, your face unlock or your like fingerprints over here. So first you have to just remove any kind of security that you have. So make sure you do that first. Let me just go back and in the security section right now I have two fingerprints over here. Now I will go over here and from here I will remove these two fingerprints option over here which I have enrolled. So as you can see right now, I just deleted two of my fingerprints and from this screen lock section, you just have to enter your pin or pattern over here to like re-enter into the settings of the pin. So from here, you just select none. Yes, remove, you select those. So after you do that, let me go back and go into the system and then the backup section. And right now, as you can see, the backup now option did appear. So right now, if I just tap over here, it will start the backup automatically. Let me just wait for the time being. And yeah, it shows could not back up right now. So for like to fix this, you just have to reboot the device once I guess. So let me just reboot. So once you rebooted your device and go into the settings and you are still connected to the Wi-Fi, I'm guessing. So let me just go into the system and the backup section. Right now, I'm just tapping on the backup now again and waiting for the time being. And right now, I guess it will start the backup. Let me just see. So yeah, as you can see right now, it says backing up your data. So that means the backup is right now actually working fine. So next time I flash a new ROM, I will just like set up with my Google account. Then it will ask me to like restore from any Google app data backup. Then my device option, the Redmi K20 Pro, it will say like when the last backup was. So it will say for me, it's like about 30 minutes ago or like some different date. It will show you that particular date over here. So do not worry. You just select that option and set up your device and everything will be backed up from the cloud. So that is the most safest way to back up your things over here in my personal opinion. And by the way, the backup also includes your app data, your SMS text messages, the device settings, call history and contacts as well. So this is a really handy backup and I do use it on daily basis. And that is how I restore all my backup or text messages or call logs, etc. from these particular backup while I change most or all of the ROMs over here for each devices like I can back up over here and I can restore this particular backup to my Redmi Note 7 Pro 2 or any other device for that matter if I'm using the same Android version and like same account of my Google account over here. So that's been it guys. Thank you so much for watching this video and we just crossed 23,000 subscribers mark. So huge thanks to all of you guys who have subscribed to the channel. And if you have not subscribed yet, and if you like this different kind of video, do hit the thumbs up and subscribe button as well. If you are not a subscriber yet, and please do hit the thumbs up button. It helps the channel out, pushes the videos a little bit more in the search and stuff. So yeah, that's been it. That's how you fix your waiting to backup in the Google Cloud or Google App Data Backup. So this is Tito from KD and Tech signing off for today and I'll be catching you guys in the next one. And until next time, do wait for this Evolution X review or something, which I am working on. So yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye-bye now.